Heads up. Over this here. Be worth it. Heads up. What you need? Hey. Do you have a minute? I think we should talk. I'm listening. Go ahead. You're gonna have to bear with me. This isn't easy for me to say, and I want to get it right. Where do I begin? Did you know I spent three years fighting at the combat zone? Three years of getting beaten to hell by a bunch of losers and lunatics. After the matches were over, I'd spit out the blood, stitch me wounds, and do a couple of shots of Psycho to keep me going. I fucking hated it. I hated the crowds, I hated the other fighters, and I hated myself. I never understood why I put myself through all that. Until now. It was because I was alone. And I think deep down, I wanted to die. I wanted one of my opponents to crush the life out of me, the easy way out. Well, that's the past. You're not alone anymore. Then maybe you know what I'm trying to say to you. My life's been nothing but one huge failure after another. You've heard all my stories, and you know the prices I've paid. There were a few times, when things got really bad, that I... I found myself staring down the barrel of my own shotgun. I don't know why I didn't pull the trigger. I guess I was praying that I could find a single decent scrap of humanity in this fucked up world. And then, what you did for me back there at Fault 95, it was like the answer to those prayers. That's the first time in my life I fully depended on someone else, and they didn't let me down. God damn it, I'm making a mess of this. You're not messing anything up. You're doing just fine. I'm trying to hold it together. Maybe I should just get to the point. The longer we've been spending time together, the more I'm beginning to realize what you mean to me. And I'm not just talking about you watching me back or sharing a drink together. I mean more than that. Before we met, I'd never let me guard down around anyone. I didn't dare. But with you, I feel like I can let you in and see me for everything that I am. For better or for worse. Look, I can't go back to the way things were before we met. I won't. But what I need you to do is look me in the eyes and tell me you feel something too. This is a lot to take in. I'm not sure how to answer you right now. I was hoping we'd see eye to eye on this. You know, share the same feelings about our friendship. It was stupid of me to put you on the spot like this in the first place. Don't worry about it. This doesn't change a thing between us. I'll still keep the bullets off you and drink your sorry arse under the table. What are friends for, eh? 